guys hope you're having a great day today. Today is Monday. Happy Monday morning to you. I hope that your morning is going well. Today is actually Valentine's Day for us, but in our household Valentine's Day, we don't really do too much Valentine's Day because it's Madeline's birthday today. So we're gonna do a little bit of like Monday motivation because I have to clean my house. We had Super Bowl last night. You know, we're, we're not sports people whatsoever. We have terrible internet, terrible, terrible internet. We couldn't even stream the game. <laughs> That's how bad our internet was. So I think Jensen was watching like clips on YouTube later on at night. I'm like, hey, what, whatever you gotta do. So we just don't have that good of an internet out here in the mountains. The price you pay for living in the mountains is no internet, but I'm thankful for what we have because there are many people that live in our area that can't get anything. Can't even get phone calls working in there. Like they have to walk, sit, stand in certain places to work. So craziness, but. <laughs> Anyways, but we had a lot of food. The kids had their friends over and we had tons of food. It was all like munchies, not munchies, but it was more like um, air fryer oven foods. I had pizza rolls and taquitos and we did mac and cheese bites, which were so, so good. The Walmart brand taquitos were really good too. And then we had wings and there was a shrimp ring. What else do we have? Pizza rolls, still have taki rolls, taki rolls, whatever they're called. Had those as well. So it's been, uh, it was like the fried food night. I put out some chips and salsa, so that got devoured. There's only a little container left. Um, most of our food got eaten for the weekend. Not all of it, but most of it. We'll probably have a leftover day today. I didn't eat our shepherd's pie at all. That's in the fridge, so I might save that for tomorrow. I was gonna freeze it, but I'm like, hmm, maybe I'll just eat it tomorrow. We'll see how the day rolls. But so today's just gonna be a great day. It's gonna be a good day for little Madeline for our in our home. She's doing birthday. She's getting her ears pierced. Hopefully today. Hopefully. I didn't call, which was bad. We actually go to a tattoo parlor. Yeah, call me crazy moms, but if I could give any advice to you younger moms, when you get your kids ears pierced, don't go to like the department store or, which I did, we did with a couple of our girls. I went to the tattoo parlor and I'm like, genius, the woman that did it, she was like a certified or whatever you have to be, like, nurse so she do, does needles all day long she like does that's all she she worked on the emt paramedics so she's like oh yeah i have to do so many ivs every single day so she's she's certified so she knows what she's doing she has to be certified to do that thing when you go to those the little stores which is okay that's okay you pay a lot more for one and you're just getting people that are just trained whatever by the store people with the plastic thing so give some advice and go to the tattoo parlor. I didn't believe it and I talked about it and someone told me, they even said that um, you can do it at like a ear, nose and throat doctor too. I don't know, I didn't ask ours so I don't know. Actually we don't go to ear, nose and throat doctor so I couldn't ask my ear, nose and throat doctor but I don't know if that happens or if that situation too but the tattoo parlor, I want to say, and it's a lot cheaper, they, um, I want to say Claire's ends up being like $85 or something by the time you're done, you go to the tattoo parlor, it's like $35. I don't know, just I feel like a better thing. So we had to kind of like convince Miss Madeline because Madeline is is the girly girly. She's very, likes her dresses, likes her hair curled. She's she's dainty girl, so she's like, no way am I going to a tattoo parlor. Not that she's against tattoo parlors. She's just just not that kind of girl. So, and that's okay if you are. But then she, the other, Brooklyn's been trying to convince her like, um, no, you much rather would have the needle in your ear than, than the little gun shooting. So she has convinced herself she is going to. So today, hopefully, I have to call because I didn't, uh, I didn't call last week. I've got the lady's name over here, Martina. I need to call and see if she's gonna be there today. So get, hopefully, 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 we'll see how the day goes. If not today, we'll have to do it a different day. So we're hoping to get that in today. And then she wants to go to Chick-fil-A for lunch. And then she needs some new boots. She got um, some little boots for, I think whenever, whenever we went clothes shopping before Christmas or whenever we went clothes shopping for the year, she got her boots and then um, they need to be replaced because they're getting all, they're all, the toes are all scuffed up. So I thought, why don't we go get her some boots? And then she is doing birthday party this weekend with her girl. She's got two girlfriends coming over and they're gonna have like, Jane's gonna do fairy hair, which by the way, I have a piece of fairy hair in my hair. I, I don't know if I talked about it in the video, but someone said, I like your fairy hair. And I'm like, did I mention the video? J I was Jaden's, um, I was Jaden's guinea pig. She she got a fairy hair kick. She got it done and she's like, I like this. So she bought one on Amazon, way cheaper. And so none of the girls were like, I don't want to do that. So I was like, you can do my hair. So she did my hair and today I went to do my hair and there was like a strand there's somewhere right here. I don't know where it's black. So it's kind of hard to see. But anyways, I have fairy hair in there. So she's going to do fairy hair. She We bought some of those poppin' cooking mini food kits that we got at Christmas. We got a couple of those for each of the girls. Um, I think she wants to do slime. She wanted to do what else? Her, the nails and then just play, just have fun girly play. So 
it's gonna be a good so she's like so if you don't see a lot today it's because she's gonna do more towards the end of the week so it's it's just gonna be a good day today so got up and you know sometimes you have those mornings where you just like do you ever feel like just those burdens of the burdens of life that happen and sometimes they just like are stuck with you you know I was reading scripture and I thought I would share it today with you I was reading 2nd Corinthians 12 verse 9 and it says but he has said to me my grace is sufficient for you and that grace means my loving kindness and my mercy are more than enough always available isn't that pretty cool that God's mercy is always available for us regardless of the situation it doesn't matter you could be screwed up heathen doing the wrong thing but his mercy is there for you always more than enough uh, for my power is being perfected and this is talking about God's power and is completed and shows itself most effectively in your weakness when you call upon the Lord for when you're going through things and you just feel drained you just feel like you can't do any more you know when you read stuff like this you go all right God is, you're being perfected inside. Like God is perfecting you. Where you don't even think that. You might feel like you just want to claw back in bed and go back to sleep. Been there, done that. But you have to remember to stay strong. You got to read these truths out in God's word here so you can get those in your head and go, okay, it's being perfected in my weakness. Therefore, I will all the more gladly boast in my weaknesses so that the power of Christ may completely enfold me and may dwell in me. So when I am weak, guess what? That power of Christ is inside of me to keep me going for my day. People always ask me, how do you do what you do? Is it because you're <laughs> like, you, you get just super high energy all the time? No, no, I can go sit on the couch just like everybody else. I can stay in bed and watch YouTube videos just like everybody else. I can be lazy, take a day off. I can do all those things. I can sit when my house is trash. That doesn't bother me. Like, like I, I literally can just leave this stuff and go, it's okay. Sometimes I like it cleaned up, but not to the point where I have to feel like I have to, have to, have to, or I'm not going to be able to relax. I can relax just like everybody else. But what keeps me going every day is coming here, sharing with you, and knowing I'm doing good for my family. So that keeps me going and knowing what God has me do every day. So that keeps me going. So when you think of this, so when I have my weaknesses, I can say, you know what, today I'm feeling kind of rough, but you know what, God is inside of me and he's making me strong and he is gonna get me through my day today. So that's your focus for today. Let me keep reading here. Um, so I'm well pleased with weaknesses. You can be pleased with weaknesses. Did you know that? And also insults with distresses, with persecutions and with difficulties for the sake of Christ. What? You can be pleased with weaknesses, with insults. Anybody ever tell you, call you a name? Anybody ever with have distresses on your life where you just feel, what is going on? Anxieties with persecutions. Anybody ever attack you over things? And difficulties where you're like, I don't even know what to do. For when I am weak in human strength, then I am strong, truly able, truly powerful, truly drawing from God's strength. Yeah, it is, it's easy to be happy and have a great day, motivate and do things when life is great, right? But like when you get those bills that come in and you don't know how to pay, when you have that relationship problem with your spouse and you don't know what to do, when your kids are doing things you don't know what to do, you have stresses of the world and medical problems and all these issues that go on, it's really easy to get down and wanna lay in bed all day long, right? Yeah, I hear you, me too. But if I remember who dwells inside of me, the greater one dwells inside of me. And guess what? He is where I'm gonna draw my strength from. He is the one that I'm gonna draw from when I'm weak. When I'm weak, he is strong. He's gonna keep us going for our day. So that is my prayer for you. So go look that one up. I'll probably put it at the end of the video. Second Corinthians 12 verse nine. I read from the Amplified version, just a good little version. So, all right, today's gonna be a great day. It's gonna be a wonderful day. It is gonna be a good day because the greater one lives inside of me and he is gonna keep me going because today I'm cleaning my house for my kids, for my family, for us to dwell here. And I'm gonna get to go out with Madeline and take her out for her birthday. So it's gonna be a great day today. So you guys ready? All right, let's put your butt in. Got coffee, we got some cleaning up too, not too much, but just in a little cleaning of the house. So, all right, let's go. Someone don't help you when someone don't help you through the rain when feelings don't matter and everything's nothing but a game game just know that i'm with you just know that i'm with you through it all and i'm gonna be there whenever you win or if you fall
right, so the kitchen cleanup is like super simple, which is really good. I have some bananas that I have to put in containers. I have a few pans here that need to be washed. This, I bought these on Amazon. They said they were stainless steel. Yeah, they're not because I just put one of those like um, dishwashing crystals in here and it turned it black. That doesn't happen on your stainless steel so, or aluminum, whatever it is. So this one's ruined. So I'm gonna put this outside and then we'll wash these up and then we're gonna be able to move on, which is awesome.
Okay, so all of my chores are done. What an easy Monday, just getting everything done. Kids aren't even moving yet. They're starting to move. Greg brought some Valentine's treats for the kids here. So it's been a good day. Monday is gonna be, it's gonna be easy Monday. So now I'll just kind of see what we're gonna do for Madeline's birthday. I have to wait the, I looked at the tattoo parlor. Look at the tattoo parlor. They're not open until noon. So I'm just gonna have to wait until they open to see about getting her ears pierced. So we'll just have to wait on that. But everything else easy easy morning chores done we've been keeping up on laundry trying to do like a load a day so that makes it so mondays aren't like tons of laundry so i've got everyone's basket down there ready for them to put away and then i have one more load of towels in the dryer and then i'll see if there's any more downstairs but for the most part the cleaning is done so see even this morning it's like i didn't start till late but just a few hours of work kind of film so it takes a little bit longer and just getting the things done helps hugely. I'm going to put my bananas away here. I'll probably do that. And then um, Maddie, I think she likes dippy eggs and a bagel and orange juice for breakfast. So when she's ready for breakfast, I'll make that for her and then we'll take her out for Chick-fil-A and get her some, her new shoes and then uh, see about getting a piercing. We'll just see how life goes. So good day. Good Monday. Remember, you got that strength from the Lord no matter what, right? He's living inside of you. The greater ones live inside you. He's going to give you that peace, that manifestation of his spirit, which is total peace it's not like a fake peace it's not something you can just put there and just like turn on turn off it's it's there it's his presence just like fear like you ever feel fear you ever like walk into a dark room and like you can just feel that fear creeping up on you on things right or walk into a situation just feels that way the same thing with peace you can have that peace that you just feel and it just encompasses you and your life and what you're doing so but focusing on him and keeping your focus on him so i will see you in a little bit i don't know what else we'll do today just gonna get the girls up and see how life is i got a bunch of teenagers i gotta take places and drop off and just make a good day so all right motivation monday for madeline's birthday all right maddie's moving and grooving so she wanted me to make her some dippy eggs so i'm making the eggs over here for breakfast with some toast easy breakfast for her Okay, we should the eggs with bacon and toast. Simple, easy breakfast. All right, so it has been a good morning. Been getting a lot of things done, a lot of stuff in the house finished, and then just been uh, chilling with my kids. So now is when the time we're gonna go take Madeline to go do her birthday fun. So we're hoping to go get some um, stuff at the mall for her, and then also take her, then church camps, also take her to get her her um, ears pierced. We're gonna see. So here she is, the birthday girl. Bop, bop, bop. It's Madeline. Madeline, it is your birthday. Birthday. Which number birthday? I'm 11. She's 11, so we're gonna be hopeful. We're gonna go get to the mall. Hopefully get her some new shoes because her shoes are, see her shoes, look at she needs some new shoes. They got some Does total. that church the rugs? Yeah, I, I did the crazy. same. They know I did the same thing. So we're hoping to get some more of those. Get some earrings maybe because we're gonna get ears pierced. My friend, she bought me already. She already got me earrings. Sure, she she was like, oh, for your birthday you can get like earrings and I was like, oh, Okay. So Maddie's, Maddie's the pressure to get her ears <laughs> pierced right now. So we're hopeful. The the, t the, earring, the piercing place says it's open, but there's no answer. So, so we're going to be hopeful that we can get that. So then she picked going to Asiana's to eat. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to go have a good day. So we got to do mm -hmm. some running real quick, and then we're going to get over there and have fun birthday. You ready? Yeah. Fun birthday. And then this is like half birthday because you're going to birthday this weekend with your friends. Yeah. So it's kind of like just a little bit of celebration, but it's just a fun afternoon. So we're going to go have fun. You guys ready? Mm -hmm. You're ready. All right. Here's, here's Guinea Hen. Look at it. This is, who's this one again? Um, this is what I do. His what? name is Asher. This Asher. Sure. I put him in my marker, but I put, the, uh, I put the pad in here. Yeah, so he doesn't. So then, whenever he has to go to the look bathroom, at, look at Asher. <laughs> She's like, oh, look at now. Look, he'll jump right, right up on her neck. Watch this. Wait, ready? Like Give him a minute. Give him a second. He'll jump right up. This Watch this. Right. Like look at that. <laughs> look at, he's like, let me go hang he's up on so your cute. neck. He's so cute. So fun. So a little Asher. Yeah. Uh, did yours do that too? Uh, Not no. as much as no. Stevens oh. does. Look at this. Let me climb through your hair. So fun. All right, little Asher. Little secret. Wait, we're zooming. He's zooming. Gotta touch the camera. Boom! He's like, what? And for my birthday, this is his my dad dropped off some stuff so, for Valentine's Day. Yeah. So I have some of my favorite candy. You got some rips and you got some balloons. They saw the balloons and the flowers yeah. today. So that was nice, nice I little birthday. And you guys got brief jerky. You guys got some and nice Valentine's for your dad. I have bouquet of flowers. And yes. I've never had roses. No. Wasn't that wonderful? I have a daddy give you roses. Yeah. Must be your special. 
<laughs> All right, we're gonna go. See you later, boys. You guys need to stay here. Stay here with Brooklyn. Have fun. Oh, oh, oh Asher. Asher. He's fine. He's fine. All right, Asher wants to be on camera again. Bye, <laughs> Asher. Asher's just bumping like crazy. So fun. All right. Well, Over here, Maddie. This one. We're going to shoe encore. They don't have the same one she had before. We can keep looking, though. Boots. All right, not a whole lot of boots. Yeah. No boots. So we're gonna go to CJ Maxx. Go find some fun things in there. Maddie's yeah. looking comfy. You want to do white, which is, white's fun. That comes like a mint, vanilla, and lavender. Oh, this is grapefruit. You want one of those? Mm -hmm. I just don't. I got a cute lot of little love things. She was looking at the nail polish right here. They got some little soaps, little rose petal things. All right, so we found some. What did we find? Bath bombs. bombs. That's all we're going to find in this store. Ooh, one of the girls' dream come true. Claire's. Do you like those ones? They're cool? Yeah. Well, first let's... Look at this little flowers. Those are cute too. What she think? Look at she think of some heart ones. Those would be cute. They'd be dangles. <gasps> this has a little clock on it. Look how fun little trinkles. Look at oh, isn't that green? That's so cool. I've actually seen people make these. Look at all these little watermelon ones. Mm. The fruit ones are those cute. Oh, those are very cute. That's cute. We're looking for like a little or organizer this? for earrings. So many choices. All these and I don't even have my ears we don't even have ears pierced. We want to buy all these things, but look how cute. These are our choices. We got buy three, We're get going. three free. Yes, buy three. So get we three got free. these yeah, ones. These ones are cute. Because I do like coffee. Coffee. <laughs> these ones. Those ones are cute. And then we got just Food some ones. fun ones. Love those. And then this one. That's pretty the green. And then we have hearts. Little Valentine's one. Love it. And then we have this one. That's and it's pretty. a little dressy Look up for like church. Cute. No, he's <laughs> fun. All right, let's go pay for these one. We'll see if we can get some things done. Spinach. Okay, so she got some cute, they ran to get a Duncan decaf coffee. So they um they got cute earrings. We got cute earrings. Hopefully we'll get some cute ears pierced today. And then um her bath bombs. That was what we find. So I'm gonna have to get her like an earrings case on Amazon. Maybe they didn't really have anything at the store. So we'll look for that. But they're gonna they're going to get a little. She likes her decaf coffee mixture. <laughs> so fun, fun. Then hopefully we'll get some ears pierced. We're gonna just have to wait and see. So be a fun day. Beautiful sunshine. It's actually kind of not bad. Up almost 50. So great day. Okay, what you get? You got some. Well, then it's at the bottom. It's at the bottom. Um, and Duncan, it has a oh. <laughs> to try. Oh, it broke! Oh, no. Wow! You got a hard time to eat a coffee. Yeah, cute. It, 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 it goes back to together. Go like that, so. that looks cute. That's a very cute one. All right, we just pulled up on the tattoo parlor. I noticed there's a big giant boarded up door. Not We're looking too good. Not looking too good. So we're gonna see. I don't know. We'll find out if uh, this will be good. Are you shaking? Yeah, I'm kind of shaking. She's shaking, shaking. Are you super excited? Yeah, I'm. I'm it's gonna excited be great. Because maybe that open. No tattoo place. All right, found this place called the Lady Trap. So we're gonna go see if it's, uh, what it's like Daddy's gonna go in. <laughs> we're gonna send Daddy, Maddie. Does that sound good? Mm -hmm. We're gonna send Daddy. Okay, having zero luck in the tattoo parlors. I feel like everybody's out of business or just not available. So we're gonna see. We're gonna go get some shoes at GB's. Hopefully find her some shoes here. Okay, so change of life plan. So not having any luck for, um, <laughs> piercing anywhere so we are going to go back to our original place Claire's that we said we were not going to do but we are going to do because all of the piercing places like the one we went to is like boarded up the other one they were open we went there and there was nobody there um we tried calling out some show they're not open for like till Wednesday Thursday but every time we call the numbers they're like disconnected so I don't know if the industry of piercings was wiped out or what so we have convinced her to go back to Claire's that's where we're gonna go so I she's like that's gonna be the bad one I'm like well it's not the ideal number one choice but it will it's like so bright right here I'm like my eyeballs are bright there you go but it's it'll work and be good so she's she's getting a little hang, hangry she's so she's like, I think I'm just hangry. So we're getting her some fries right now just to kind of tidy over here until for a little bit because she's, she's getting a little like indecisive. We're not finding shoes, all, you know, all the worries of life. We got pet palms and we got earrings. So that was a good thing, but we didn't get all the, the shoes and we didn't get the ear piercings. So she's going to run in. They're going to get some fries and then come back out and then we'll go across the street and go get the earrings done at Claire's. So it'll be fine. <laughs> Oh, the fun things of life just adapt and overcome I tell her and then what I'm gonna do is let her look at these earring holders here see if there's any of these that she wants on Amazon because they're only 10 bucks they were 20 bucks for a tiny little case and it wasn't very exciting so we'll let her pick one out and we'll just order it all right Maddie are you ready 
We're taking you to the place that we said we would never take you to. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't say that. We did. We had her like all stoked up. Like, yes, we're going to do the tattoo parlor and it'd be great. And then, you know what? All of it's closed. Everything's it's closed. 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 Everybody's, everybody's shuttered. So we're going to go see. We're going to go get ears fished after this. Why do you have that McDonald's? Oh, at McDonald's. That's, right. That's because she's hungry. So we're going to go inside. It'd be great. Okay, hey, desperate go. times call for desperate We got to do what you got to do. We got to do what you got to do. <laughs> all right, we're back. We're going to get some ears pierced. Okay, great. Easy, man. You got it. Oh, oh yeah, yep. Yeah. Look at Dudley. There you go. No, look at Dudley. That's right, Maddie. Ooh, the little earrings. All right, Maddie. How do you how do you feel? Good. Would you recommend it to another 11 year old to get her ears pierced, or would you tell them don't do it? <laughs> uh, yes. Yes, do it. Endure the pain. You did it. And they look really cute. Look at it. now. We got. We didn't pick her birth stone, but I think I don't, what is this? August. She's green. Green looks really pretty with her. So we chose green. That looks nice. All right. You did it, Maddie. Here's dress number one. That's pretty. Okay, dress number two. <laughs> Pink's cute. Good. Put the pink. Pink. Oh, cute. That's cute. Look at that one. Yeah, That's cute. Like that one's one. cute. Yep. Found a tie dye one. That's cute. This one for summer green. I like it. Okay, I think that's. Oh, what about? Do we do the green army one too or no? That's just going army. I like it. Maddie loves dresses. She's easy. This one I think we're going to say no to because it's a little bit wider through here. I think that's going to be weird. All right, look at that. Dresses and ears, pairs. Life is great. Loving life, Maddie? Yep. Loving life is 11 dresses, earrings, freedom. <laughs> Everything's great. Dresses, earrings. Bath bombs. Bath bombs. What else do we get? All, my favorite things. All your favorite things. All good. All right, going to Asians. Look, it's the whatever that is. The ball, the lion. All right, we're going here. Delicious. Oh, yeah. Delicious food. Oh, is she doing shrimp? Love it. Doing good, having a good birthday. Uh -huh. Delicious food. And my ears don't hurt anymore. No, so no. all healed. Thank goodness. <laughs> now we're gonna go get some dessert. Your food, mommy? I love my food. Has sugars, this delicious, and coffee rolls. I got ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> Loving it. We got fortune cookies. Which fortune? Can we do fortune? My daddy's chewing. Let me see Maddie's fortune. A quiet evening with friends is the best time for a long day. <laughs> <laughs> Should have some quiet. In our house, that's not available. That is an eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. <laughs> Beware the fury of a patient man. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Did you have a good birthday dinner? Mm -hmm. Good day? Yeah. Happy to spell your earrings? Mm -hmm. Yes, love them. All right, we're going to go head home and see how the fun we do. All right, we moved Maddie to the front row so we can mm -hmm. see her up here. So, did you have a great birthday? Uh huh. Yeah, I did. And it's still not even done. This was just like uh -huh. a glimpse of a birthday. Mm -hmm. Well, on either next Saturday or two weeks. I don't this know. Saturday. This coming Saturday. Oh, this, this Saturday. This coming Saturday is a fun birthday with friends. That kind of tops yeah. one out with mom and dad. I'm gonna have. But it's still fun. Yeah, I'm gonna have my friends over, and we're gonna do all sorts we're of. We're gonna have a good fun. Maybe we'll, we'll film what they do without yeah. filming them too much. So it was a good day today. Got good food. You got pretty dresses. You got your ears pierced. <laughs> she got the coolest earrings. Oh my goodness. They had like little coffee earrings. I'm like, I want those earrings. Mm -hmm. So it's a good thing. So yeah. we're jamming to some music in Kento. Is that what it is on the way home mm -hmm. here? So we're gonna yeah. drive home and call it a night. Sound good? Mm -hmm. Happy 11th birthday. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> happy you were alive. <laughs> I'm my Valentine baby. I love it. You're my Valentine baby. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing. So, all right, we're gonna go ahead home now. All right, we're gonna do our outro in the dark here. So it's been a good day. Yeah. We're home. You can hear Ruby barking. Bark, bark, bark. Let us know the mountain. Look at the mountain. Look how pretty it is. Look at that. The sun going down in the mountain. Ruby can see so pretty. It. Ruby's like, I'm here. Just so you don't know. 
All right. So we are gonna close today's video. We're gonna close today's video. So I wait. Do you know what I said at the end of my videos? Do you know? You guys uh, watch you my say, videos. What do you guys say? What do you say? All right. You guys have a fantastic rest of your day. And remember, remember, you're beautifully made. I like yeah. that. You are beautifully made. I say you. Um, I don't know the rest. I say you're designed. And created. created and selected by God to do great things. You know that you are designed, created, and selected by God to do great things? Yes, I am. You are. He's got some great little gifts in you that is, I can't wait to see what he's going to do with your life. Mm -hmm. So for you, you're designed, created, and selected by God, and God's going to do great things in your life. You just got to let him do that, right? And walk that path. So mm -hmm. have a beautiful rest of your Monday, and we will see you guys again tomorrow with a... But what? <laughs> oh, I wasn't sure if you knew what I said. Tomorrow with a... Another, Another video. Okay, video. sorry. I don't know how much they watch my videos at all. So I just thought you guys, they're like, no, what, mom? They just tease me in the front. So, all right, we'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Bye. 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 <laughs> Good job, Maddie.